okay hello everyone it's me best thing so we are going to continue from where we stop the first part we register a domain and uh, a, a, a hosting plan so we are going to continue so the domain we, we register for instance if you register a new domain on that uh, let's see or oh, domain king we enter it after registering we enter it into this thing it will not show anything now remember i replaced that bested247.com.ng with nigeria.com.ng so don't be confused still the same thing okay so you will see nothing you see this so you have to go back because why you see that because there's nothing on that website there's nothing on that hosting so let's go and install wordpress and use it to build a website you build a blog website okay Enter the main. Okay, so I have you, you go click here, go to login. So you will log in with the, the password, whatever you used to register the other time. So it will take you to this place. You can see. This is it. It will take you to this place. Now, when you look at this place, you'll find nothing here. So what you need to do now, you just go to so you click, you go to the top, you click my service. My service. Okay. So when you click my service and you come down, you will see the website you post the website you you register for you see that button here and you scroll you see this button here click it this small button here. so we take you to this place you can see information about the the, web, the hosting you can see it the price now we are going to log into the cpanel that is where cpanel where we, we, we install we are going to install that wordpress so let's click Login to Cipana. Now it will take us to this. When you enter file manager, it will take you to where, as in the, the as in the, the size they give to you. That's it. It will take you there. So we have to go back. Guys, know what we are here for now. We are going to store WordPress on that website. Okay. So back so you scroll 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 go to you find something like like this software you find this you find something like this okay software close app installer so you click it this software close app installer will help you to install any software that you need on on your website okay like now wordpress is a software we have dropper we have many 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 there are many so click on it so it take us to this place now installation why you see four here is because i have installed four websites on on this account before that's why you you see the four so I want to store new one okay so I will click when you scroll down you will see WordPress anyone I want to store you can see it like this Presta card is used for for buying and selling websites so you go here install After click install now I will click on top of this install I'll click on top okay now I'll click on top so you take me to this place choose the version you want to install mm -hmm. okay the choose a solution you are you have to put it to HTTPS okay now you have to select you have to select the as in the the, as in the, the the main 
that you want to restore so you have to select it or you have to select it here and java.com.ng okay now the blog name the website name you can leave this maybe you can say learning learning blog okay my learning uh, you can subscribe anything as you like affiliate my learning whatever okay so you leave you go you go this is the password you are going to use to log into your 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 this thing as in the back of your website okay so you can change it you will change it you have to change it but i'm not going to change it yet okay so the email you can put your email okay so i reset my email the language okay 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 so you have to click install now it's now installing the this thing now after the installation if it give us a message successfully wordpress has been successfully installed at www.nigeria.com now when i enter this site it's going to show me the wordpress site now you can see hello world this is the wordpress site you have installed a wordpress site on dial link and you this there's nothing here so this is the face now to go to the back you come back you will see something if you want to go to admin login, you have to put HTTPS, you have to put this ad, YP admin. So when you click on it, it take us to where we log in. Remove that ad. Skip your skip this. Come over here. So it will take us to this place. Okay. So what you need to do now. This is where you start to do the working, the working of the website. Start installing plugins and themes. Okay, so in our next lesson, we are going to install a, a, a themes that we can use for plugins, uh, a blog, and plugins that we need to use. Then we will install a demo data that will help us to set our our website within a, within five minutes. Okay, so this add interface, the back of WordPress look like. Okay, so thanks. Stay tuned for the next video. It's me, best thing.